Donkey Kong. The images that name puts into your mind are unforgettable. Whether it's the classic arcade games or the great platformers that came later, there's just something about this big ape that everyone likes. As I prepare for my big DK feature, I'd like to just talk a little bit about the game, the character, and his legacy. Donkey Kong was more than just an addictive arcade game. It was the first appearance of Mario, though he was called Jumpman back then, and as we know, Mario is one of the most recognizable characters in any form of media. More kids today are likely to recognize Mario than they are to recognize Mickey Mouse. But for whatever reason, the big gorilla doesn't get as much respect, despite it being his name on the game. And after a few sequels and ports, he was pretty much forgotten about. His last appearance was Donkey Kong 3, a game that wasn't even a big success. However, his son, Donkey Kong Jr., would go on to gain a lot of fame. While he first only appeared in supporting roles in games like Super Mario Kart, developer Rare reinvented the Donkey Kong Jr. character as the new Donkey Kong, and the old one became Cranky Kong. Their Donkey Kong Country series, or Super Donkey Kong, depending on where you live, finally gave the character a chance to shine, and in some ways, the popularity of his games rivaled Mario for a while. Today, he's mostly known for games focusing on rhythm, but for a while, DK was the man. Or the primate, I guess. When attempting to play every DK game, or at least as many as I could possibly do, it's a massive undertaking, and something I've planned for a long time. I want to be as thorough as humanly possible, but I don't want to be too redundant, so with the early arcade games, I'll be doing a full video for each original arcade version, while combining the videos of the ports where I can. This feature is going to be divided into three parts. The first part is the main Donkey Kong series, which spanned the first three arcade games and the ports of those the Game Boy game, and the new Mario vs. Donkey Kong series. The second part will be the Super Donkey Kong series, which covers Donkey Kong Country and Donkey Kong Land games, as well as the newer platformers. Lastly are the spin-offs, where I'll cover all the weird shit. Lastly, as a bonus, I'll do a playthrough of the classic mode of Super Smash Bros. Brawl, playing as Donkey Kong. So, I hope you will enjoy the big DK feature. I happen to know a lot of you guys have been waiting for this for a long time. So enjoy. Necro VMX, out.